Hey guys, it's Tiger. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to Stardew Valley Expanded Joja Edition. Let's check our mail today. Hey Tiger, I just heard you moved from town. Wait, I just I just heard you moved from the townsfolk, so I wanted to officially welcome you to the valley. My name is Mia and I am one of your fellow neighbors. Why don't you come over sometime? Sterling, Henry, and I live over in East Scarp, and we'd be happy to have you. I love having guests over for lunch, but as I'm sure you are very busy, I've enclosed a treat for you. Ooh, nice. I hope to see you soon. Mia. Bear pancakes. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Dear neighbor, I hope you are feeling settled in your new home. I am writing to let you know that Pierre's store is now selling fertilizers. Why don't you swing by and see if you can afford a few dozen boxes or so? Yeah, sure, Pierre. I'll get right on that, sir. All right, I am going to water the dog and water the crops, and I will bring you guys right back. All right, so I planted down 10 spring seeds that I could actually make. I chopped a couple more trees just to get them out of my way. I'm going to grab these rocks right here. If I can grab the right tool. And we're just gonna get this out of the way as well. All right, let's, um, let's see what we got here. Have that kale in there. I'm gonna sell that and i'll keep the rest of the kale i do want to work on getting some more coal for to make more preserves which we have pickled kale going right now but i do want to make a couple more i want to get up here and get this lovely salmonberry bush okay and do i want to Go over that way and grab this one. Yeah, and it looks like our rice is done too. So let's grab that. Up, oh, some of it went in the water. Of course it did. That's the disadvantage of planting it near the water. But I'm gonna put the rice in there. Yes, I have hay. I have a mod, but it's okay. I'm gonna put that in there, that in there. We're gonna sell these two, these couple of things of kale. Let's see, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Oh boy, I should have thought about that. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So 1, 2, no, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 2, 4, 2, 5, 2, 6, 3, 7, 27. We'll get like 28 seeds just to be on the safe side because I don't think I counted that right at all. And I mean, I may not be able to afford 28 seeds, but we'll see what we can do. And then we will go and check out something new. I want those salmon berries, but I don't want to stop right this second. Um, I don't know if I have an earth crystal. I do not have an earth crystal, so I'm sorry, Linus. I'm not going to take that. I wish I could, though. Oh. Oh, this is the cutscene that I always skip, but I kind of can't skip it this time. Welcome to Pierre's. How can I help you? Ugh. <laughs> I really, really, really don't like him, you guys. Ugh. Ahem. Jody didn't turn and look, at least. Demetrius didn't either. Come and get it, folks. Coupons, 50% off. Purchase at Joja Mart. Ugh. 50%? Well, any takers? Ugh. Morris, I don't like you. But I can't match those prices. I'd be selling at a loss. It must be so difficult for you to lose your loyal customers like that. 
But can you blame them? Joja Corporation is clearly the superior choice. Yeah, you think that. Soon, the whole town will realize that. Sadly, they probably are going to realize that soon. <laughs> Just because the way I'm playing this. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, hello. Have you met Henry yet? We grew up together. Currently live up the road with Mia. If you want to come say hi. They're pretty neat for letting me stay with them. Sterling. Oh, Sterling. I do all my grocery shopping here. Yes, yes, I know. So I said like 28 seeds. Let's go five tulips. Five jazz. And apparently only 13 kale. Well, we can get... We'll get two more tulips. Yeah, we'll do that. Sterling. That, that's the one you want, you guys, just so you know. But I'm going to run go show you where they live really quickly. Oh, hi, Gus. I sell different dishes each week, so make sure to check in every now and then. I will. I do want to go and uh, speak to Morris and see if I have anything that I could actually give him because I do need to become friends with Morris. I don't want to, but I need to. If you need cheap seeds, there's no better place than Joja Mart. Yeah, huh? I'm not giving you my bear pancakes. I will give you an apricot or a cherry, whichever one I have more of. That would be a cherry. You're not getting my apricots. This is delightful. Uh-huh. Oh, great. Okay, I'm level two. Uh, Shane. Shane's hard at work. He doesn't seem interested in talking. Okay, never mind. Martin. Uh, hi. Hi. You Juliet? Yeah, you're Juliet. Hey, Farmer Tiger. Looking to plant some crops. Ours are genetically enhanced. Nah, not really. I just made that up. They're just seeds. <laughs> I love Juliet too, though. So I did ask if I should add this extra mod and the people that responded, my good friend Lori and Kit and I want to say Aqua Tammy were the ones that responded and said, yep, go ahead and add it in. So I've added it in and I'm going to go show you where they live. Um, Sterling is one of them. Absolutely love Sterling. You'll find out along the way. And a lot of you may like Sterling too. He does have a lot of problems, but... He's okay. And if I have the right mods installed, Shane is a little bit different because Sterling is in the game and Shane changes a lot, whichever way it goes. Uh, I need to go to Pierre's for some groceries soon. I don't know why my mother doesn't just hire a butler already. Hey, are you thinking about a part-time job? Um, Victor. Victor. Oh. That was rude, wasn't it? Apologies, Tiger. I lost my composure. Yeah, that was a little bit rude. Oh, no, I didn't want to. I, I, I don't want to. I don't want to click on that. I wanted to click on trash can. Thank you. And I want to click on this trash can. And now, if I'm not mistaken, you cannot gift Mia anything. She's just an NPC. But I believe Henry can be gifted. But the only one that's single and able to be romanced is Sterling. Let me see if a certain little cute girl is out here real quick. Somewhere around. Maybe. I think Jazz is the only one I'm working on, really. But I would still like to work on Little Miss Cutie Patootie in here. Let's see. Um, up. Oh. No, she is not in here. I don't think I can get in her little treehouse. No. Okay. That's okay. I have checked the map and I actually don't see her, which is odd because I would think I would at least see her, but I don't see her. So I'm going to grab this and we're going to come down here. And whoa. 
this is where Mia, Sterling, and Henry live. And look, it's Dad and Buffy. Bark, bark. The sound fills you with determination. I love the little puppy. He's so cute. This is Sterling's room over here, if I'm not mistaken. This is Mia's room and this is Henry's room. I think Mia and Henry are like boyfriend and girlfriend or like really good friends or something. I don't remember exactly. But okay, yeah, Rosa is not in here because I just saw Rosa. Let's go speak to Rosa. Hi, Rosa. Back in Fort Joseph, my dad's bakery had the most wonderful aromas. The war rationing stopped us from making cakes or sweets, but we improvised. I don't know. Is she coming down to open this up? I will double check. Just seeing if there's anything on the beach while I'm right here. Besides a crab. Get my sword, please. Okay, that's fine. Um, nothing to collect. Okay, 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 okay. That's fine. Rosa, are you... Okay, no, she was just coming to look at the beach. I didn't think she would be coming down to open this late in the day, but figured I would wait around and look and see. Another... Okay, let me... Oh, there's Henry. I can go speak to Henry. Could you do me a favor and check up on Sterling when you have the time? He's a great guy, but I do worry about him while I'm away. Sure thing, Henry. And I don't know why. It's like whenever you add them in later, it's like you already know them when you don't. But, I mean, it's okay. I do want to risk grabbing cherries and apricots just because they're good gifts for people. So let's grab what we can. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, gotcha. I know. I see you, Red. I see you. Now, I know I told you guys not to come up here. I'm going to show you why. Ah. <laughs> um, hold on a second. That was, whoo, they were like, look. I think they're like iridium bats. They just look different up here. But you see I'm barely doing any damage to these things. And she she kind of slid off screen on her own. But it's okay. Now is there anything else I want to do here. While I'm running around. I think. I don't want to run out of time or anything like that. Yeah okay. We've already come up this way. There is more stuff up further. But it is a little bit late and I don't want to be out too late, you know. So we're going to... Whoa. Hello. Uh-uh. Bye-bye. You guys are going to be hard to kill. Hi, Aiden. Oh, hello. Marvelous weather, don't you think? A fabulous day for reading in the garden, sheltered by a wonderful scent of rose and lavender. Um, Yeah, but it's kind of late. This is Mia. She's so cute. It's very important doing wait it's very important doing our best to stay healthy thankfully it's easy to eat fresh and organic with all the wonderful crops grown around the valley you are right you should come and have some lunch with us one of these days i would love to mia and maybe one day i will boy them things hit hard Ugh. This is Sterling going home. Yeah. Ah, damn. My pizza dinner. Sup, Tiger? Sorry about that. I might have had a few too many. Shane and I were playing a drinking game while watching Clint. He doesn't exactly like being done up. Maybe you should play with us one of these nights. We'll cash in on those drinks I owe you. It won't leave you wanting. Um... It sounds like a fun time, but I don't know about getting that drunk. 
Yeah, maybe not this much booze, though. I work early tomorrow. Guess I should head, head home before Mia drags my ass back. Good night, Tiger. Good night, Sterling. Could you not tell Gus about that mess? Thanks, Farmer. Yeah. One thing, Sterling is very, very, very easy to please. Because he loves filled snacks. So he's very easy to befriend. I don't think I know anybody that even likes filled snacks. Hi, Penny. I'm tutoring the kids today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. Um, Penny, it's like 9.50 at night. How are you tutoring anybody? But okay. Is he actually still in here? No, but Shane is. Can we speak? What do you want? Hey, have you met Sterling yet? If you like bothering me this much, you'll like bothering him just as much. Okay. If you want me to upgrade your tools, you'll have to give me the correct ore. And you'll have to pay me a, f a fee, of course. Yes, of course, Clint, of course. Hi, Aaliyah. Hello, neighbor. We both live outside of town. Does that mean something? Um, not in this save, Leah. Sorry. Hey, Gus, give me another round. Hick. Had to clean out some gunk from my trash this morning. Uh, that was just a couple. That was just a little bit ago, Gus, but okay. Bagged it up and called it a day. I'm so sorry, Gus. Happens more often than you think. Oh, he looks so sad. I feel so bad. I work part-time at Gus's saloon. It pays the bills. Um, Emily, darling, sweetheart, you're you're working right now, but okay. I'm going to check these trash cans really quick. Okay, and I'm just going to go back up this way. Grab these salmon berries right here. And I'm going to check down by the bus to see if there's any more salmon berries over this way. Sometimes there's a couple. There we go. I mean, I know there's more bushes. I just didn't know if any of them actually had salmon berries on them is what I meant. Is Martin still walking this way? Yeah. What do you like? You take an apricot too. Or a cherry, I think. I like this. Thanks. Oh, you're welcome, Martin. And it's a little bit late, but not too late. We don't have a lot of energy, but maybe, just maybe, I can chop down one or two more trees. If I eat a little bit, anyway. Get you. Oh, there's a... Okay. And you. And you. Yes, I know. And you. We're at 11, 8. Guess we're not getting a couple trees, huh? We're going to get one tree. Let's grab some more hay. Get this path just a little bit more cleaned up. That's all food. I need, oh, sugar, honey, iced tea. I need to plant. But I should have enough time. And I have everything already watered, so that's fine. Yeah, put you there. And you there. And we'll just fill in the rest with the couple of seeds that I have. And... I don't... Do I have any... Tools. I do have some. Okay, that's fine. And you there. And okay. Now we're good. 
I'm going to put these away. Put you in there. I'm going to put that in there too. I'm going to put this in food. And this in food, obviously. I'll keep the field snack on me for Sterling. We are going to go to sleep. We're going to see how much money we made. Oh. Level 5 farming. Choose a profession. A rancher. Animal products are worth 20% more. Or tiller. Crops are worth 20% more. We're going to go tiller. We got 1,921 for 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 13 pieces of kale. That, that's not bad. It's not a lot of money, but it's not bad. But that is our day done. So I am going to have to call this one an episode. It looks to be like a little bit of a shorter episode, but I can't squeeze two episodes in one day. So we're going to call this one an episode. Look at all these lovely little things we get to pick in the next episode. And make some money and maybe buy some more seeds we still have time let's see how how much longer do we have here let's see last day for green beans is the 18th last day for strawberries we can plant spring seeds on the 21st we can plant more more kale potatoes rice and tulips by the 22nd and we can do more parsnips by the 24th so i mean we do still have plenty of planting time so i will probably buy some more crops to make more money but for now i am going to call it an episode look at this no more rain through the whole entire of spring unless something's not right there Okay, that's weird. But yes, I am going to call this one an episode. So I want to say thank you so very much for watching. I'm sorry I was rambling. And I hope to see you all in the very next one. But until then, bye guys.